Fiala lost control of the puck and it rolls away from him. The Flames try to get it out. Can't get it past Johansson. Second attempt right onto the tape and they will step out. Up the middle now. Control goes back across and a chance there for Monaghan and he could not finish. Here's a big shot. Scores! Hennepin into the corner. Zarnik now banks it to Bennett. Bennett puts it back and they move it across to Hannafin. Stepping in now and going across. There's Zarnik with a shot saved by Sarles. Vancouver the other night. He felt it was one of their worst games of the year and expects a lot more of a pushback tonight. Freddie Gaudreau now in there, tipped in by Grimaldi, and Smith makes a good reaction save. Another shot, and that one's tipped just wide. Backs it up ahead to Fiala, into the middle now for Hartman. Hartman curls back and then puts it back into the corner where it's intercepted by Calgary. Hamannick gives it up to Johansson, down as Smith makes the stop and holds on. Simmons pulls it backside, it's going to be picked up by Watson now into the final minute of this first period. Roman to Yossi, Saucers went in there, tipped, and they score. Colton Sissons found it on the business end, and he has tied the game. But just a choppy play. This puck was bouncing all the way up the ice. It was on edge right here. Look at this little chip pass, one bounce off the hop. The three for six, by the way, in the two previous meetings against the Preds. This is a power play unit that has been making teams pay, but not so far tonight. And now Panina with a chance to step in. Short-handed. Did not get a good shot away. Smith. Deep in his own zone. Being watched there by Monaghan. Monaghan's got control it in front. Throws it back to Anderson to Brody. Shot goes just wide. Rebound to Anderson. Low shoots. Sounds as a rebound batted by Monaghan. Comes back to the line for Brody. Lost control of the puck. Back to the line for Hamannick. Hamannick to Lindholm, down low, top line, going to work. Out of the corner comes Gaudreau, poked away from him. Hamannick sends it back in. Turned over, here's a chance, Monaghan scores! Had a couple good chances, a redirection that just went wide off the cycle, just a good job, get the feet moving, keep the play alive. And for Monaghan, he funnels around. And he's the one that starts this off as he... Back to Anderson. Anderson steps away from Bonino. Sets up a one-timer for Brody and a save made by UC Soros. Across to Ekholm. Leaves it for Craig Smith. Smith snapshot, scores! Gets through Smith from long range and it's tied. Face off to the left of Smith. Here's Ronaldo with a shot saved by Smith. As Ronaldo found a loose puck, another drive from Ellis goes wide. Josie puts it in there, kick saved by Smith. Ryan against Sissons on this draw, he wins it, pulls it back to Shillington. Shillington to the line, there's Kachuk, scores! Tipped in front! And the Flames have the lead back. Quickly funnel to the net, face-off win. Nice drop pass here to Matthew Kachuk, who kind of comes back, gets himself into a position to shoot this puck. And Calgary starts out again. Rick wide to Brody. Brody taps that into the corner, waiting for it as that goal. Getting on him is Austin Zarnik. Poked up ahead to Gaudreau, turned over to Anderson. In front, Quad in there, scores! Welcome to Calgary, Alan Quad. Quine signed as a free agent by the Calgary Flames. Played 84 games with the New York Islanders the last three years. Corral then puts it in there and it's kicked aside by Smith. Picked up by the Flames again and they're gone. Off the center, Sean Monahan stops, shoots, gets it back in. There's a great save. Extra attacker on for the Predators. The OC being watched there by Lindholm. Hamannick with a chance to move it up the boards. Does. And they get it away. Gaudreau. Nice play by Monaghan. He holds the puck, finds Gaudreau. Gaudreau, instead of trying to force this one through Ellis, just waits for Lindholm to get into a spot. Lindholm makes no mistake. So the Calgary Flames have a date in Edmonton tomorrow night. And they're going to go in as the top team in the Western Conference.